Hi, I'm Tim, and welcome to WatchYouWant.com. Thanks for logging on. Today, we're looking not at a clash, but a collaboration of superpowers. In the luxury goods world, Hublot and Arturo Fuente cigars are both known for producing some of the best goods in their class. And both are somewhat flamboyant, somewhat outlandish, not afraid to be a little bit bold. And bold is the theme of this Hublot Big Bang King Power Arturo Fuente Limited Edition. Now, Arturo Fuente was originally founded by, who else? Arturo Fuente Sr. in 1912 in Tampa, Florida. But the thing is, the company has really come of age under his son, Carlos Fuente, and Carlos's son, Carlos Fuente Jr. And in 2012, as the company celebrated its centennial, Hublot got together with the founder, or the, I should say the founder's son and his son, to issue this limited edition Big Bang King Power a series of 100, if you look on the back, you can see it says Chateau de la Fuente and 2012-1912, that 100-year span with the images of Carlos Sr. and Carlos Jr. amidst their tobacco plantation. Now, this watch right here is outlandish in its size, its scale, its proportions, but not really its color scheme. It's a muted, elegant, dare I even say somewhat refined combination of Hublot's signature king gold, red gold, and subdued tobacco tones with just enough contrast to impart an impression of elegance and I might even say nuanced beauty. If you've got the wrist to pull this off, this is one of the more attractive and elegant Hublot's for a formal occasion. Perhaps not suit and tie, black tie, formal, but maybe an upscale club, maybe an upscale smoking club. And tobacco is the theme here. Now, in addition to the Opus X signature series of cigars referenced right here on the subdial, uh, Arturo Fuente is known for a number of blends that really run the spectrum from exceptionally bold to exceptionally mild. And you've got a little bit of that in different parts of this Big Bang King Power. Now, the color scheme is very consonant. Nothing really clashes. You have the black titanium PVD bolts in a bezel of king gold. You have an inserted rubber bezel surround. You have a composite insert between the two sandwiched layers of the red gold case. There's a gently contrasting stitch on the hornback alligator and rubber strap. Now, rubber straps are a signature of Hublot. Their natural rubber is second to none, very supple, very soft on the wrist. But what's nice here is they do give you that real alligator leather content, and it's sewn in by hand with this contrasting stitch that pops just enough that it doesn't become an undifferentiated expanse of brownish black. A really nice, again, dare I say it, subtle touch. And the dial itself continues that theme. The little shocks of red are just lively enough to animate the dial and give it some life and a... I would say a playful slant. It's also nice that despite a relatively subdued color palette, there's a lot of contrast here, and that really adds in the attractiveness of the watch. You can see that the applied rose gold indexes, rose gold hands, they really shift as the light passes over the uh, anti-reflective, it's only single-sided anti-reflective crystal right here. But there's no difficulty in judging the time and reading the subdials, which, by the way, are a beautiful contrasting, subtle contrasting black against the tobacco background. Again, those red shocks really just make it pop in person and really help the watch to come alive. As big as it is, it just doesn't seem outlandish. It seems like one of the most fully realized Hublot Special Editions. It seems like something that was designed with an eye toward refinement in addition to size and impact. And that really comes across... Again, let's just talk about the case back. Even the contrast between the different tones of the illustration is subtle. You look at it for a moment, and then the images of Fuente Sr. and Fuente Jr. come into resolution. You look at the case back, and it's, it's just, it's not a display case back. It's not sapphire. It's not outlandishly engraved. It's just a beautiful, subtle illustration that pays tribute to the father, the son, and the tradition that they've really helped to create the modern tradition of the Dominican cigar in the United States. In the uh, aftermath of the Cuban embargo in the 1960s, Arturo Fuente was actually instrumental in bringing about the rise of Dominican cigars in North America. It's kind of ironic that I'm reviewing this just as the U.S. reestablishes diplomatic relations with Cuba, but hey, maybe that's a new place for Fuente to source tobacco, so all is not lost. But the bottom line is, as a timepiece taken on its own terms, you don't have to be a fan of cigars or Arturo Fuente to enjoy this Hublot Big Bang King Power 
Arturo Puente Limited Edition. The color combination is attractive. The contrasts are subtle and appropriate. The color scheme, if you like gold, and if you like colored gold, is ideal because everything fits beautifully. From the buckle, which is a combination of black PVD titanium and 18 karat red gold, through the brown hornback strap, right up to this large red gold case and the consonant tobacco dial with the red shocks. All I can say is, personally, I don't have the wrist to pull it off, but if you do, Bully for you, because this is about as good as it gets in the world of Hublot Big Bang and Big Bang King Power Limited Editions. With every complication you'll ever need, it's automatic winding, it's got a jump date, and it has a chronograph stopwatch. This is a very complete package. Again, maybe not tuxedo formal, but definitely more refined than your typical outlandish Hublot or Audemars Piguet Big Bang Limited Edition. This is a rare effort and one of Hublot's all-time bests. I'm Tim for WatchYouWant.com. Check out this Arturo Fuente Limited Edition Big Bang King Power by Hublot on our website, watchyouwant.com. We are the pre-owned luxury watch experts. Check it out in high resolution, and I'm convinced, again, if you like gold and you have the ability to pull off a 48mm sport watch, you can't do any better than this Hublot Big Bang King Power Arturo Fuente Limited Edition.